what's going on guys Kelechi here so this is my full camera review of the Techno Camon 17 Pro and I believe someone out there is probably looking out for this video so as to help you make the best purchase decision I'm going to be testing out the camera of the Techno Camon 17 Pro in every possible way of course it is a camera centric device and I will test out every single lens it's a quad camera combination and I will test out each all of them to tell you what it looks like I'm currently shooting at 4k 30 frames per second and the picture quality is awesome I love the saturation and the colors are well defined so I will be switching to 1080p right now okay guys now I'm shooting 1080p at 30 frames per second I love this one because colors are punchy the saturation and the contrast level are okay okay guys which one do you like the 4k video or the 1080p to let me know in the comment below so the techno camon 17 pro device is a big step forward especially in the camon series of techno a slick looking mid-range and also a good budget device and going forward i believe techno will not go below standard in the next device maybe they come on 18 or 20. so the camon 17 pro sports a quad camera combination of a 64 megapixel main lens an 8 megapixel ultra wide angle lens a 2 megapixel macro lens and a 2 megapixel depth sensor lens you have the mediatek Helio g95 system on chip here that spices things up on the camon 17 pro not just good for gaming it also enhances your camera experience so you can have a good detailed photos and also optimizes your videos with the mali g76 mc4 gpu for smooth rendering so when you launch the camera application on the techno camon 17 pro the phone welcomes you with the AI cam mode on top and it automatically informs you of the object in front of your camera. So you can switch to the beauty mode if you want your images automatically beautified with extra fine details and make them social media ready. You also have the portrait mode where you have a particular object in your image kept in focus while the background falls out of focus. And then you have the super night mode to improve the quality of images taken at night especially in dark areas. So let's take a first picture and see what it looks like. So guys, if you're watching this video, please touch the red subscribe button if you're new to my channel. Thank you so much guys. When you swipe up, you also have other camera modes like the AR shot, panorama, ultra HD and slow motion. So starting with the picture qualities of the Techno Camon 17 Pro. This is an ultra wide angle image from the 8 megapixel lens. Although a lot of details are missing here, but it is not bad at all. The color of the sky remains the same. The colors of the flowers are not completely blown out. You can see tell it's a green color, although there are noises, but you can carefully pick out details as well. And looking at these two images, you'll notice a big difference. There is a change in color and also object focused. On the AI cam or the normal mode, the sun is directly hitting on the object, causing its over brightness. But it is still detailed. On the portrait or bokeh image, it is focused on a particular object for definition. But looking at this image, the sun is not direct and you have a good and balanced color reproduction just the way your eye sees it. Which means the Techno Camon 17 Pro camera can do well in both good and poor lighting conditions. The 2 megapixel macro lens on the Techno Camon 17 Pro is not bad at all. The blur effect on this image is really nice and superb. Honestly, it is similar to the human eye, how close we get to see an object. This is very colorful and detailed. Even in video recording, it does not disappoint in any way. Another interesting feature that the Techno Camon 17 Pro has is in its video recording. The ability to lock focus on an object and capture its accurate color. Every detail is at present and it feels exactly the same way your eye sees it and also locks focus on a particular object. This is so awesome and beautiful and I commend Techno for this. The saturation is really not a problem. Yes, of course you can edit your footage after. It is the clarity in each footage that makes it unique. So guys, if you're watching this video and you're needing a good photography experience from a son, I recommend the Techno Camon 17 Pro. It is good, especially on a budget and as a daily driver. The camera is not a disappointment in any way. You also have a 48 megapixel clear selfie that gets your images ready for social media posting. So in conclusion guys, I would say that I highly recommend the Techno Camon 17 Pro camera. 
it is not in any way a market gimmick but it is good available for $300 or 125,000 naira so what do you think guys please let me know what you think in the comments below thank you so much guys for watching the video and thank you for subscribing to my channel if you're new and watching the video as well please follow the link in this video description to my social media handle i'll catch you in the next one peace